So, um, uh, Frank, you got a slide for me? Yeah, perfect. Thank you. So, as you can see from the slide, uh, we had lots of great ideas, and um, some of them were similar in in their um, in the idea, but generally there was a really amazing breadth of ideas across that continuum of 30 years. So, thank you, thank you, everybody who contributed to that. Um, but unfortunately, you know, there has to be a winner. We, we've got three finalists, and I just I thought I'd share those finalists with you. So, uh, finalist uh, one, uh, this was a resuscitation. This was a holographic, real-time, interactive clinical expert on the scene, uh, supporting the paramedic to do CPR and giving them real-time coaching um, to the tune of, obviously, in this instance, it was the Bee Gees, wasn't it? I think so. Yeah. Another finalist uh, was uh, the paramedic, clin paramedic clinical advisor. Oh, sorry, that was their role as a, as a person. Uh, this is um, drones with primary care medications following up on tele-triage and referral, and particularly getting to lower socioeconomic areas that have no access to primary health care or can't pick up their own medications. And the other... Uh, finalist, to be able to provide my patient with the highest level of care using a exoskeleton gloves that can be used, operated remotely, regardless of the level of uh, ability of the wearer. So three great finalists. There has to be a winner, and our winner is the primary care drone, and that is um, Heidi Little. Is Heidi here? Heidi? It's always great when they're in the room. Otherwise, well, actually, I'd get to take it home. There is a prize. Come on, Heidi. What I can, what I can guarantee now is that your flight home to Wellington will be much more enjoyable with these on. <laughs> yeah. And again, I'd just like to um, thank Trapeze for this great initiative, um, harnessing all that knowledge that's in the room and all the ideas that have come out over the last two days. That amazing piece of artwork, thank you for that. We will digitalize. Oh, yeah, round of applause, thank you. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So that amazing piece of artwork will be digitalized. That will be up on our um, website, I'm sure, in not too distant time. But um, the important thing about that piece of work is that we will use those ideas to help form a white paper which helps describe the future of paramedicine um, in Australia and New Zealand. So I'm really looking forward to doing that piece of work with Trapeze. So thank you guys. Uh, finally, uh, as you would be aware, Trapeze was running a second competition on their um, booth, and that was the jigsaw competition uh, for the uh, connected journey of the and the winner of the jigsaw competition is Nicole Bastian. And Nicole, are you here? Run after her. <laughs> no, well, let's, we'll make sure Nicole gets the prize. Thank you.